Larian and Rudy are raising a family. This is how life should be. This is their story. Hey guys, what's going on? It's your girl RJ here sitting in a car on my way to Michael's. I'm gonna read the scripture of the day to you. It comes to us from 2 Corinthians chapter 5, verses 14 to 15. For the love of Christ controls us, having concluded this, that one died for all, therefore all died. And he died for all, so that they who live might no longer live for themselves, but for him who died and rose again on their behalf. Amen. Don't forget that Jesus Christ died for you guys on the cross, okay? Just don't ever forget that. So, oh gosh, I'm so hungry. <laughs> I'm always hungry, right? But listen, I went to Michael's last night and I totally forgot some very, very important items. So I have to go get them now. And I'm, I'm, I'm really annoyed because Saturday mornings are for family time. And here I am sitting in the car talking about going to Michael's. But I need to get some white yarn for a baby blanket that I'm still not done with and I'm so annoyed with this blanket. <laughs> but it's it's like I can't do anything better. I work I work on the blanket from like 1 to 2 a.m. And that's the only time slot that I have to work on that blanket. But it's like taking forever, but I'm almost done. And of course I ran out of yarn. Then I also need some string to make all the necklaces and bracelets that I have to make for this huge order that I have to give out to someone tomorrow so that is the situation right now let's go do this cue the music guys I did a bad thing I bought more than what I was supposed to buy but I do have good news I used three coupons so I was able to save like i think like five or six dollars that's good right they had 20 percent off all items your entire purchase including sale items 50 percent off one item and then they also had a 40 percent off all jewelry making items so you know they had some really pretty yarn and i'm gonna go because people are waiting hold on yeah so i'm a part of a group on facebook called crochet addicted <laughs> and people have been posting about the new cotton cakes you guys probably have no idea what I'm talking about because you don't crochet unless you do so yeah And I'm like, oh my gosh, when are they gonna bring that to Stanford? So I go into Michael's right to get the baby yarn which I got and I'm leaving and I look and guess what I see Cotton cakes. Are you kidding me? I couldn't believe it. I was so excited I stood there and and deliberated for like five minutes Maybe it was ten minutes, but I was like get it get it and then I was like no you don't need it and then I was like but get it like it's five dollars and I have a 20% off coupon get it so then I ended up walking out of there with five with three skeins I've been pronouncing skeins wrong my whole life I thought it was skeins it's skeins yes yeah, so I got three of them joints oh my goodness I am so excited I'm gonna make so many cute dresses I have the black wall street event coming up in September you know and i have the christmas show so i need the yarn to make stuff this is me justifying my actions yes like a tidal wave crashing over me rising into me your love is fierce like a hurricane that i can't escape nam 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 in a while guys guys i'm home long time Jaden is sleeping i put him down jonathan just woke up from a 37 minute nap and rudy well he didn't just discover but i was like hey are we gonna watch uh marcus limonis and he turned on hulu and guess what there are three new episodes for your girl to watch i'm so excited i, I got up i grabbed my glasses i've been working on the blanket because i was trying to get it done by 1 30 but it is currently 12.55 and I'm nowhere close to being done. You wanna say something, Jonathan? You wanna say something? How was your nap? It was good? You liked it? Did you dream about bunnies and playing and eating and drinking all the milk? Yeah? Yeah? We moved ourselves down to the kitchen because Mr. Jonathan 
Mr. Jonathan wants to eat some food. It's either that or he's still tired. A 37 minute nap was not enough. Today is supposed to be the day when we're celebrating our anniversary. I don't know if you guys know that. Did I mention that before? We're gonna be married six years tomorrow. So since tomorrow's Sunday and it's pastor's appreciation all day at church, we decided that today we were going to spend the day with each other, hanging out. Uh, we're gonna go see a movie later and have dinner tomorrow. Yeah, Jonathan, anything else you want to tell? Did I miss something? No? Okay. Yeah, so right now I'm currently working on a bracelet slash necklace set. So I am going to turn this joint into a necklace and a bracelet. Boom, done. Yeah. Jaden woke up from his nap earlier than we thought he would. He only slept for like maybe an hour and 50 minutes instead of his usual two and a half hours. So I'm gonna go get him now. I'm trying to like stay awake guys and I don't know, I just feel so tired. I'm, a, I'm tired all the time. I went to bed last night at like three o'clock. Hi Jaden, you smell like poop. You happy? You had a good nap? All right, careful Jaden, not too hard, not too hard. So the plan is to feed this kid lunch and then I don't know what. I have four bracelet sets that need to be made by tomorrow. And I've only made one so far. So the plan is not going too well. Jaden, are you excited? You excited to be awake and alive? Yay! Hi, Jaden. What do you have to say? Yeah. Yes. Is it disappointing? Uh huh. Yeah, Don't touch. Yep. It was a bite. Are you gonna miss your mama? Are you gonna miss me? Yeah. I'll see you tomorrow morning. Okay. When I come back, you're gonna be sleeping. We're going out. Bye, Jaden. See you. I no. Yeah, I know. Guys, let me tell you something. We're in the car and we're on our way to mommy's house. That was so boo. <laughs> Leasing. I took the most bangalicious nap. I don't know. Sometimes when I take a nap, I wake up and I feel more tired than I did before I took the nap. But today, I just kind of like rolled out of sleep. You know what I mean? And I was just like, yeah. Was cool. I liked it so much. Then I took a shower and now we're on our way to Mommy's house to drop off Jonathan because I asked Larik if Jonathan's talking now that he hears me talking. I asked Larik if, if she could keep Jonathan for the night, she and Mommy. Just so that Rudy and I have a little break because we usually try to like go all out for anniversary. In the past years we've gone to different countries. And last year we went to New York City and spent the weekend there. But this year we're on a tight budget in life and we're trying to not like, you know, overspend. So we're just going to be at home. <laughs> we're gonna go watch Wonder Woman and eat Popeyes. And then tomorrow we have, uh, we're gonna make a dinner reservation at a Brazilian restaurant. And that's how we're gonna spend our sixth anniversary and I'm totally okay with that. So, are you excited, Mr. Rooney, to see Wonder Woman? Yeah. That's one of your favorite kinds of movies to watch, right? Well, yeah, like action adventure. Yeah, I'm interested in the movie, of course, because it's called Wonder Woman. So, I, I'm interested, and I heard that a lot of girls, like, cried <laughs> in the theater because they were just so excited about the female lead role. I know, it's so corny, but... <laughs> But that's how some girls feel, you know, because you don't really get to see such strong roles, I guess. I mean, I don't know, honestly. I'm just making this up. <laughs> but I'm excited. Bye-bye, Jonathan. See you later. I see you tomorrow, okay? Oh, well. I see you tomorrow, okay? Yeah. Look crazy. Oh my goodness, looks like there's a tornado over there. I see 
Popeyes. I'm about to grow up. Guys, I've never been to Popeyes before, so this is very exciting for me. Larry can't believe that I've never been here, but you know, there's a first time for everything, and I'm really excited. Guys, the food is here. Rudy got his, what did you get? Three piece? I'm about to steal one of them joints. And I got what they show in the commercials. Wait, this is what it comes with. Like. <laughs> oh, the shrimp is in there somewhere. Yeah. And then we got an apple pie. All right guys, so we're back in the car. Rudy, how did you enjoy the food? It was good. Well, it wasn't your first time there, right? Yeah, it wasn't my first time. It was my first time. My first time. You will always, wait, how's the song go? Uh, For the rest of my life. That will always be my first time. My first time at Popeyes. Yeah. Miss a turn? No, I didn't know it was a shortcut. Oh. I mean, it's not. I don't think it's a shortcut. Shortcut lead to blood. <laughs> anyway, guys, you guys know that song? It's a really depressing song that a woman is singing about her first love. Yeah. I used to listen to some weird music when I was younger. Oh, me too. Like, thinking about it now, it's like, oh gosh, was I, was I emo? Yeah. Or, or like, Oh gosh, I, I don't even have a girlfriend yet. Why am I listening to all these love songs? But you know, it's funny because we grew up in a time where the music was like really lovey-dovey, like really lovey. It wasn't about, girl, I want to see you in the club and I want to have sex with you tonight. It was like, I love you so much with every, every fiber of my being and I'm going to love you forever. That was the kind of music that we grew up with. But the music today, boy, I don't know. Anyway. So, yeah, the, the Popeyes was very good. I, I enjoyed it so much, but I didn't get to finish it because we only had like 10 minutes to eat that joint. So we took it to go, and I'm going to sneak some of it into my bag to see if I could sneak it into the theater because, you know, I got a big-ish bag. Big-ish. It's not big enough, but we'll see what happens. We made it, guys, and I took some apple pie and juice. That's all I could fit into Ew, my bag. <laughs> I should have taken more because nobody's even looking at me like, what you doing, girl? <laughs> The movie is over, but Rudy wants to stay. Yeah, just because you're after credits. And so that we can make out. We're leaving the movie theater and the movie was awesome. It was a good movie. I don't know if Larry liked it. Yeah, I did. Yeah. It was good. It's the, I think, what is it, the second installment? Or third? I don't know. I can't remember. I know that I saw, I saw the Superman movie with your sister. You saw and what? The, the first one? With Larique? Yeah, I saw I saw Superman with Larique. Then I when came and saw- When did you see that with Larique? This was at your mom's house. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we watched it together and then we we saw Batman versus Superman together. Yeah. And now we saw, we're seeing Wonder Woman, or we're, we saw it. It is good. Yeah, I liked it a lot and I was actually trying to figure out why girls were crying because remember I said that girls cried? Oh uh, yeah, I guess. I felt it. I was of, like... Of that scene, maybe. No, it was like, I don't know, she was just so passionate about like women and children and you know, basically just all human beings and I just felt the emotion of the film and I, I was like, I can totally see why someone would cry because of the movie but it was a it was a very good movie i definitely suggest that everyone who's into like action stuff go watch it because it was it was pretty good so we're gonna what are we gonna do now we're gonna go say hi to jonathan <laughs> yeah we could go we could go say hi to jonathan real quick and then we can go home because Jaden's sleeping yeah yeah so well i hope he's sleeping so we're just gonna go home and work on a couple jewelry pieces because they're due tomorrow <laughs> and then we go enjoy the rest of the night guys as soon as i came home i went straight to the kitchen and started working on the jewelry pieces with rudy rudy took a break to take a shower and then i continued to work then he came back and finished helping me so i just have one more jewelry piece to make tomorrow i'm really proud of myself i can't believe that we made two necklaces, two bracelets, and one set of earrings tonight in like an hour. I think that took us an hour. What time did we get home? Like 11.30? An hour and a half. <laughs> Alright, but I'm, I'm so tired. I gotta take this makeup off my face. 
it's like whenever you wear glasses i think you have to wear extra makeup on your eyes so that it can show so i guess no one can notice how i botched my eyelids i mean it probably looks okay in camera but to me it looks kind of funny but i had such a good time tonight dear you had a good time yeah yeah happy anniversary it's one o'clock yeah, that means it's our anniversary you remember what we were doing at one o'clock six years ago mm -hmm. i was sleeping <laughs> you remember that remember i left your house mm -hmm. at 3 13 in the morning yeah i was yeah, sleeping yeah. on the floor oh my I goodness remember, remember. yeah that's crazy but we'll talk about um our wedding day in tomorrow's vlog okay guys thank you so much for watching i really appreciate you i hope that you give this video a thumbs up because you liked it so much larry Ann and rudy are raising a family this is how life should be this is their story